All right. I didn't really rehearse this video much. I thought about researching beforehand, but I decided not to because I'll see what the viewer response is first. And if you guys like this and have more questions, um, not just clicking like, I, I mean, if you actually tell me in comments or send me messages saying, hey, I liked that video, I want to know more, I'll go ahead and research it. Same one. Now, the Midwest area, I've looked into the Asian, because I've been to Chinatown, Chicago, so I've looked into the Asian holidays, festivals, and so on within the Midwest. And uh, it's it's going to sound weird, and I may be mispronouncing this, Des Moines, spelled Des Moines, Des Moines, Iowa, which is the capital of Iowa has a festival in May called Celebration. Uh, they also have some nice Asian grocery stores and other festivals and some areas in the city dedicated to the Asian community. Um, park type deals. Uh, nothing too major. Uh, some art exhibits. Well, In the 50s, from what I've heard, and I, I trust the guy, um, the information may be a little off, like I said, I'll, I'll research this if you guys want me to, and gals, <laughs> my viewers. Uh, in the 50s, there was some sort of monsoon in a particular portion of Japan. It did a lot of damage, uh, destroyed livestock crops, houses, made things complicated. Oh, and I will be looking off away quite a bit to read here, uh, since I haven't rehearsed this. And I don't really rehearse much my videos, if at all, at times, especially lately. Anyway, so there's this disaster, this monsoon. And uh, Iowa, Des Moines in particular, sent aid to one of the harder hit areas. Um, let's see. Kofushi in Yamanashi came. And they sent hogs, pigs, lots of to help feed, uh, replenish livestock, whatnot, whatever hogs and pigs do, besides end up in meals. Um, so, the Moines sister city uh, in Japan is Kofushi. And Iowa's sister state in Japan is Yamanashi Kane. Uh, Yamanashi is near Nagano and Shizuoka. Uh, the Des Moines school has some Japanese language. Uh, Drake, I think it is, has. Uh, <sighs> Japanese courses. I know some other Iowa colleges had some cultural and language studies of Japan. Uh, Unitas English School in Kofu uh, frequently accepts English teachers from Iowa. So I was, I was really interested to learn all that and I think it's really neat uh, considering You normally only see America helping, like, some dusty, underdeveloped place that's gone through some third world area, gone through some horrible disaster. That we also help more developed countries, you know, when they need it, and they give back. In fact, from what I was told, the uh, Kofu people donated a temple bell to Des Moines, uh, located somewhere near the Capitol building, perhaps on it. I don't think he said on it, though the person that was telling me about this. So, there's a temple bell from Kofushi in Des Moines, Iowa. I'm going to have to look into this, maybe go there sometime. Low gas prices are rather high. Anyway, uh, it wouldn't take me much to research this some more. And uh, it's been about a week. I really need to get around to emailing the guy. I was going to email him some of the wonderful YouTube channels because he taught English for a while in Japan. Uh, and there's some great YouTube channels by English teachers that show the 
food, the culture, the wilderness, uh, because he really enjoyed his time in Japan, and I'm sure he would love seeing that stuff again. Maybe even might contact or talk to some of these YouTubers that post this stuff. Um, really got to get around to that, although I'm rather busy today. Hopefully I, I can squeeze some time in today, because it's been about a week. Anyway, uh, video responses are the greatest. Uh, if we get some video responses going, because all the other viewers really love those too. And it helps grow the YouTube community, and if your video responses are good enough, well, I don't know, collaborations and whatnot, maybe. Uh, comments are great, gets the discussion going, or if you're super shy, message me directly through my YouTube account. Hope you enjoyed this one, and uh, probably going to record another right after this one. Sorry about the odd camera angles of looking away from the screen so much and over the top of my sunglasses. Hopefully my eyes didn't look too dark. I'm running on almost no sleep. Stayed up helping some people move, then hung out with some friends a little bit that are going to be moving soon, and then helped someone drive some or helped drive someone around early in the morning and fed some people's pets. So just haven't gotten around to going to sleep yet. I uh, had some spare time. Figured I'll get some YouTube videos out before crashing. <laughs> it is really hot out today. It's in the mid to upper 90s. Last time I checked, I'm supposed to get into the upper 90s. Just, wow. And very oppressive, sunny heat. <laughs> The driving, uh, it wasn't too drowsy while driving. I had some coffee and some tea, which I'm thinking about doing a video next on teas. Won't be all the teas I drink or have come across or the greatest, just the ones I drink the most often and recommend the most because you're probably going to be able to find these teas. Well, that's all for this one. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you for viewing. Comments. Let's get some good discussions going, viewers. <laughs>